dun, 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 dun. It is time again for the auction included. Are we even <laughs> live? Reluctant to sell. Yeah, probably. Hold on. Dun, dun. Anyways, we're gonna resume the game simply. <laughs> and uh, what is it that we're even doing here? This is all on the highest difficulty settings, and we don't have any care packages. Uh, we're trying to win and get all achievements doing this. Just win the game on the Empty Worlds, which is a modded world gen. And it is just beautiful. Just like the music. It's very loud for me. Hold on, I'm gonna turn it down for myself. Dim, dim, dim. But you should be good. You have a different uh, sound setting and audio. Good. <laughs> oh dear. Right, so the world gen is empty balls, and there is a, an island cluster. And I think it glitched out. Because I have two printing parts, and that can't be right, right? But it's fine. Well, let's just load it up and see what the planetoids are doing. Good. So we're trying to make a uh, steam room down here. And we're going to pour out Fat Cat. Fat Cat says auction included. That won't stop anyone from having a nice day. So true. Have a very nice day. Now, normally, uh, when you go to the doctor, best time is when you're ill. Now, I feel fantastic. I even did some fitness. I never tried and the fitness because I knew I get punished for doing so but yesterday I thought hey let's do it because uh, tomorrow uh, they're gonna do an MRI and uh, they're gonna see then what's wrong if you're feeling bad but I didn't even feel bad so I guess <laughs> I recovered somewhat um, I'm still not doing yard work but maybe I, <laughs> I recover so much that I can do yard work again and fitness um, I mean if that worked I only did like 10 push-ups and uh, just holding an awkward pose and that's all I did. But that's usually what killed me before. But since I'm doing the wellness now for a year or so and uh, only got wrecked a few days where I thought, hmm, uh, better not live. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but uh, it was rough. So now I'm feeling better. But um, still... I would not do yard work or do two hours fitness. Did you? Already? Yeah, I did have it. I have the uh, I have the website. They gave me a, a QR code, and I can scan that, and then that will link me to the results and link the doctor to the results. But my doctor is fantastic. He's a he's a boss doctor in a clinic for neuro uh, neurosurgery, and he only works on Mondays. <laughs> but I guess he only works on Mondays with patients that are outpatients, without patients, uh, with outpatients, not without patients, that would be weird, but it, maybe he even works without patients, just doing some science, anyway, um, he's a good guy, and uh, since he only works Mondays, I'm not going to talk to him this year, next year I'm going to talk to him, and um, it's, a, it's a bit rough, they don't have time for me, patients without patients, oh, I think I <laughs> I had a lot of patience with this five years of pain my friend five years of just pure suffering but um what can you do not much so we're gonna connect this all up <laughs> we're taking it in from above uh, which means we're going which way into the knot gate down here into the ore gate there beautiful ah uh, so satisfying to play the auction included without any uh, any issues game wise or health wise fatka says this is a perfect sad song to be playing when you're talking about pain yeah yeah it's it's been painful it's been painful hey in 40 minutes in the mri is also quite painful if you have no muscles in your body <laughs> to speak of is uh, is brutal it's just brutal why am i still using an or gate for this i mean it was all right but the last five ten minutes 
my my back hurts so bad because I was lying on the spine. It's brutal. Anyways, why am I still using this? Uh... <coughs> am I saving something if I use the the one that Fractal taught me? Hmm. Let's just put it in because everything here is in symmetry, and I like that. But we're also going to learn how to do the proper setup. And the proper setup is... Well, this is also proper, right? Proper setup is more compact. So that's what we're going to use when we, when we build it in a tight space. For example, here we use two thermo aqua tuners. Aqua tuners. Well, why do I keep saying aqua tuna? It's not a fish, it's a machine. Anyways, if you have them close together, I think it's a good idea to to do this here a bit different from how I'm doing it. Mm -mm -mm -mm. <laughs> I still got a little bit of a cough, but that also is going away. Should I pour out this liquid? Sure. Good, we're cooling down this area and this might be too much. Maybe we should be careful, but this will be the debris chiller. It's gonna be 100 degrees here. <coughs> Running through the uh, petroleum and then through the air. And then landing inside of the petroleum. Good, that thing is just chugging away. Scalding? Where? Dum, 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 dum. Game doesn't tell me. Game doesn't want to tell me. Let's mop this up. Oh, we got the chlorine here. Grab it. How's the gas looking? Dum, 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 dum. Yeah, chlorine is going upwards here. Good. It's it's a filthy base, if we're being honest. It's a disgusting, filthy base. But, uh, it's also based on, uh, like... <laughs> Fakka says, I was finally able to get some prescribed cough medicine for my cough. I've had it for over a week. That's, that's good. Over a week. That, that's long. I have had my cough now for, uh, one and a half years. <laughs> it's brutal. When I, when I had that, uh... That pneumonia, where I did not go to the doctor, because what, what can they do? <laughs> well, what can they do? They, they say, ah, oh, you're sick. Uh, the last time I talked to the doctor about pneumonia, he said, you cannot have pneumonia. If you had pneumonia, you would be in the hospital. So, what are they doing in the hospital if you have pneumonia? If you're, if you're old, they save your life. If you're young or middle-aged, they annoy you. <laughs> That's that's how it works. There is no, there's just nothing you can do. You need to rest and you need to take your fluids and eat healthy food, and then you're gonna overcome. And um, in in the older age, you you probably need a tube. You need to be intubated in order to, so you can breathe. But otherwise, you have to you have to endure. All they told me was my lungs sounded good. <laughs> that's great. Okay, that's good news. That is super duper. Oh, hey, I wanted to try out my new gas reservoir. Let's put it in. Where is it? Over here. Give it to me. Gas reservoir blue. Blue moon. Oh. Let's make it blue as well. Now let's do the neutral color, which is copper. Boop. That's gonna look fantastic. And if we build something... It's gonna be priority seven. We deconstruct something. It's probably gonna be a villain. Fakka says, "I was glad, but still wanted some help with the annoying cough." <laughs> That's brutal. They say you you sound good, but but then you have to cough. So, how's this jive? Uh, do they think you cough on purpose, or what is what is the reasoning there? Maybe they just can't hear it. It's the same with the with the liquid liquid loss in the spine. The MRI doesn't really show it. 
so I doubt a anything. The, the only thing I did today was um, find out how the protrusion looks, the how the how the disc bulge looks now after all this time. So I had it to 2018. Now it's 2023. Uh, so that is five years later. So now now they look how if the protrusion is still uh, bulging out like no tomorrow or if it got worse or if it's bulging out another way or that's all they see they they don't see the liquid loss especially if they don't use any um, what's the English word for the for the fluids you, s you put in in your body and then you see those fluids on the MRI they did not even use this and I'm sure the doctor told them to use it and they ignored it but all right does matter all that is mat that matters is my body is still healing itself that's important to me. Let's put this in. Good. Mm. Fatka says they said it was just an upper respiratory infection or cold. Yeah, the common cold is probably. Or if it's not, then you can worry. All right. Hey, I cut this. What about the? Oh, there is more oil. I could use and I will use. Um, let's empty this out. We're gonna reverse the bridge, thanks to the fantastic Knows, who definitely knows what they're doing. Dim, dim, dim. Reverse. Can we reverse this as well? Maybe there's something. In? Yes, there is. Genius. And then we're gonna reverse that one. And then we're gonna empty out the cool oil this time. How about that? Dim, 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 liquid vent. Let's go. Whoops, wrong place. <laughs> wrong place, one time. Wrong time. I took all week off from work. Yes, that get nice. You're gonna get rid of this cough. You're gonna relax. You're gonna drink the fluids. And uh, let the body heal. Do anything that helps the body to heal. Like a healthy food and a good mood. And uh, some uh, inspiration, maybe? Something, maybe uh, uh, some art. I just finished watching the movie Troll. Oh dear. Oh dear. Isn't this a child movie? I don't know. Movie for children? No, I'm not sure. Troll? Oh no, wait a minute. No, this is a horror movie. That is Trolls. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> well, easy mistake to make. <laughs> <laughs> if you're more like me. Of course, Troll, that is the horror movie, which is real good. That's that's a fantastic, that's a good good one. Um, been a while since I watched it, but I remember it was pretty good. Wasn't there a woman fighting the thing in the woods? There was a big wall around the village and she... Uh, <laughs> She went there to end it. <laughs> she went outside. She, outside the comfort zone. Um, and outside of the village where all her friends lived. Hold on. I need a uh, liquid element pipe sensor or something. Probably from gold. Good. So we're going in here and we're going in there. Now we're going to have a liquid reservoir. Here where everything is nice and cool. And we're gonna have a liquid reservoir possibly inside of here is there a room down there the gas pump we can pump if we want to so if this is a breathable oxygen then go <laughs> No, if this is unbreathable carbon dioxide, then go. Go green, go green, go green, go green. There we go. So we're pumping the carbon dioxide out of here. Genius. This movie was from 2022. Wait, what? That is not the troll that I know. How come I got the... I got the... The plot. I got the plot right. Hmm. 
That's that's a bit weird. Is it a remake? Could be, could be. Man, the air here is not good. And they keep dropping the all the chlorine. <laughs> if they if there was a way to to put the chlorine all in one spot. I guess I could help out down here. Just some chlorine storage. I guess. Good. Automation shipping. Auto sweeper. <laughs> oh dear. So if we put the auto sweeper here, that would mean I have three Taz room for storage. Storage bin, good on it. Number three. I'm just gonna say all chlorine goes in here. And then all chlorine that drops down. And it's not chlorine dropping down, it's beach stone that's dropping down, but it is given off chlorine. That is why. Now we're red, why? Because we're chlorine? Chlorine also green. I could do a secondary check. Liquid element sensor? No. Gas element sensor. Good. So if this is chlorine or carbon dioxide, then give me a green. <laughs> and that will get rid of everything until we're down here. Good. And we're running how long? Five seconds buffer? Hmm. Five seconds buffer seems pretty normal. Fekka says, I just looked it up and there's a troll movie from 1986. That's the movie that I'm talking about. That is the good movie. The 2022, I haven't seen, so I cannot speak for it. No idea. No clue. Haven't seen it. Should probably. Hmm. Picking up the gold. Interplanetary launcher. Something inside diamond. Good. Now let's check out the other colonies because I have something nice here. And that is um, a new room. Put it there. And that room is strictly for wild dracos <coughs> and nothing else. Good. These guys, they do the sleepy time in the filthy rooms. Let's clean everything up. Why not? There is a hatchling. And we drop them off here. So we can we no longer have wild hatchlings then. Do we still want wild wild hatchlings? Yeah, they can eat the rot and everything. Let's move them. Good. I accidentally swept up an egg. So eggs should not go here. Doom, 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 critter egg. Nope. Good. Doom, 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 doom. Grab this critter. This is looking great. Bum, 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 bum. Um, hmm. Water for. Oh. Beautiful, except we don't have any uh, fishies anymore. That stopped because we forgot to feed them. We put the seeds somewhere. If only I knew where. But uh, nominally, this should be grub rub seed. If we get another fish, then uh, we're gonna put them here. Chances are we don't get them. Reminds me of Ernest Scared Stupid. The troll movie looks crazy. I haven't seen Ernest Scared Stupid either. Nope. I did not. Hmm. <laughs> I also meant to check out the ceramic background tiles. And we need to dig this. That is important. Somehow the dirt here cooked into sand. And clumped up. 
good. Do we have a collection of stuff? Yes, here, of course. I just looked at it. Good, let's collect everything. Dum, 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 dum. It's time to clean the base. Seeds as well. Actually, I don't think I want grub rub seeds. They can uh, be underneath the plants. So no seeds at all? No, just not grub rub. Good, that means we're gonna clean this all up. Except for the grub rub seeds. Good. Pollution as well. Hmm. Not sure about that. So we're gonna drop all of our pollution. Could drop it down here. We could dig this. And just drop it down. <laughs> could push this water out. Drown that plant. Or not bother. We stand here, go through a... Hmm... Sure. Good, we're gonna do it all. The Ernest movie is very, very cheesy, you say. Cheesy. Hmm... Hmm, hmm, hmm. Maybe then I will not watch it. Dig this out. Good. Prioritize the build. <coughs> Prioritize the dig. Do you have a dedicated diggers over here, priorities? Click me in, game. Click me in. Lunido or Leroni? It is Leroni, of course. Digging, digging, digging. We do have a digger who's also a supplier. I don't like that much. I want the constructors to be suppliers. Let's check out if this works. Building definitely, constructing. So building and supply, no building. First, supplying as well, storing, no, the agents are for the storing. Good. Agent, this is also a digger though. Let's switch it up a bit. <coughs> Good. And there's also a doctor, but that's fine. The ranchers, not allowed to supply. Good. The constructor should be supplying, though, and building. Good. I keep switching this up. But, um, in the end, this will all just uh, be in its final stage. The thing is, if you build a colony, you start with pioneers, and then you have to prioritize what you need. And not what is efficient for a huge colony because it's only two or three duplicates. Now, this is looking good. This is looking fantastic. I like this. With a blue cord and the brown tubing in the background. Good. So now we're going to make a storage for all of our pollution. Finally. Rotate. After, I don't know how long this colony exists. Right, somebody's doing this instantly. Yep, beautiful. Grab this stuff. We got sheared. That means how much carpetals can we do? Let's do some for these people. Good. Um, and since we're gonna sleep here, I think I want some airflow as well. <laughs> Good, this is not luxury barracks. We need background tiles, how much glass is there? Oh. We have 100 glass need and six tons of glass. We should put this in the colonizer while we're here. Good, but let's make something pretty here. Hmm. Can we do something crazy? I wonder. Yeah, I don't know. Hmm. But we can do something 
different. Whoops! Glitch me in game sometimes. It's just uh, the input lag. Like, uh, like you're on a smartphone. Good. Really stumbling over the words there. Smartphone. Smart. How well, smart is the phone? <laughs> the phone is not smart. The phone is the opposite of smart. The phone is is unwieldy. And uh, and the pest of the new age. Good. Of the new age we're living in. Not the new age. The new age was uh, in the 80s? I don't know. But um, let's dig out these resources. Just so that we have them. Good. And this is going to get configured. We don't want to run through here. Not that we could do anything there. And this is going to be for organic, polluted dirt, rock pile, and slime. No, I don't know if we have slime. But if we do, do it. Errands, the agents are about to do it. Good, this agent is going to do it when they're done digging. Pretty cool. Wow, this looks nice. This looks nice. Let's check the room. Is a barracks and a luxury barracks needs a, 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 a decor item. Says one here. That's weird. That's weird. But it needs one decor item. Hmm. Furniture. Definitely not a lamp. <laughs> Wanna sleep here? Aero pot? Or let's do a regular white hanging pot? <coughs> Does it need to be high decor? I don't think so. Good, let's make it from aluminum. White aluminum. I'm excited how that's gonna look. Good. And this is the guest chambers. Alright. We're also gonna automate it. <coughs> Just for kicks. Hmm, don't know how this is gonna connect to everywhere, but alright. Gonna find out a fervine bulb. Also gonna shine some light. Body bud? How is the germs? We're already very much body budded here. Let's do a mouth leaf then. Plant. Ah, oh, it's beautiful. Beautiful room. Um, good automation. A ribbon. Hmm. I don't. I'm not sure what I'm doing here. <laughs> just, just making, making a pattern. This is, I don't think, this is necessary. So what we do need is a ribbon from Cobalt and it needs to connect up to everything. Hmm. Let's connect it like so. And see what we get from this. Hmm. Yeah, well, it's gonna be a nice pattern, that's for sure. Alright. <laughs> so we start this out with maybe an oscillator. Could. Could. So why not? Not gate? Um did a little bit. And then <laughs> we need to put it in, put it into riders. Good, let's do the riders first. Good. We need four riders. Mm 
do the the oscillator right good and this is gonna start it up and then we're just gonna do something like this which is good enough good the riders are going to connect of course dum 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 um, to each other and to this thing here good then we're gonna connect it up oh this is the wrong way around good rotate <laughs> um hmm, automation ribbon gonna say go and we're gonna say no No. Gonna say go, oscillate, and then we're gonna connect it up. Just seems extremely nominal. And then we're gonna say here on the ribbon rider number one, on the ribbon rider number two, the ribbon rider <laughs> number three, and the ribbon rider number four. And then we're gonna connect this up to power. Mm -hmm. This is not looking complicated at all. Where is this gonna go? So something like this, simply. Good. And then we're gonna find out if this is even working. Good, probably yes. Now, what's going on here? Just waiting for the duplicates to return. Cause uh, <laughs> we need some duplicate love here. Got a vacuum now, genius. So we can continue on digging everything out. And we might even make use of the debris chiller since we have a little bit of cold here now. Could be very nice. If it's too cold, we're gonna run into problems. The petroleum is going to freeze. And all other things. So, um, hmm. Uh, let's go to Lironi again, where we stopped <laughs> for a moment to fuel up our engine. There should be three, uh, three tiles range. Don't know, it doesn't say. <laughs> Three times range here, good. Inside, we're filling up with oxygen, which is good. Check that out. Uh, 920 key, yeah? What? This is not much. Hmm. We have the grub food seeds. Original, original, let's remove this. <laughs> Too many grapefruit seeds. Furvine bulb is good. What's inside this hauling point? Just some gas. Good, we're picking up the basic rat pill. How many red pills are there left? 500. But I don't think I want to consume them. Good. <laughs> Even if it's 500. Mm-hmm. Pioneer Punk W444. No red pill. Pioneer Mad Gun, no red pill. Good. Now, can we start and go back home? Because there's nothing to do here. Uh, we did the thing we needed to do. Right? Oh, what about the desalinator and everything? <gasps> we never started even working on this. And the security tiles are not in. New log entry. Cycle 1000. Hmm. Let's put the security tiles in. We'll repair the Asher here. Good. 
it's gonna be one key. Maybe that was the problem. Maybe it was just too low volume and the gassing off here killed it. Hydrogen. <laughs> Gas, one key, and it will drop, and it will spoon, and it will pretty nine. Good. Agent Doctor One is gonna do it. Maybe. And let's do it right now, though. Aged game attack. Good, and this hauling point? Similar, but here we're gonna use carbon dioxide. Good, carbon dioxide. And you're to and you're to spill. Party 9. Let's do this as well immediately. Good, grab the stuff, all the stuff. Hydrogen is in. Carbon dioxide will be next. <laughs> oh dear. Where's my desalinator? Could be here somewhere. Bleach zone. To just blow the fundamental refinery desalinator. Make it from steel. Because we can. Oh yeah, I had this built in and then something happened. Hmm. I did not pay attention to duplicate diet, is what happened. Good. No. Oh, that was rough. That was rough. They slammed into my my walls again. These neighbors. Not good human beings. Tungsten? Let's put it in. Here, there, and around. Good, and then goes in, and then goes out. Hmm. Wonder if I should do something else when it comes out to cool down. Don't know if it's a good idea, but let's try. Um, hmm. We're going to use the liquid that is at 50 degrees. That's just how it is. <laughs> or we're going to use a 23 degrees liquid. I think that's a better idea. Yep. Right, let's run this. And when this liquid is empty, then we're going to go for the hot liquid. But hopefully it will never empty out. Just going to use a regular pipe now. Go in there. Oh, and we're running bad. Badly. It's unreachable. Cancel. Deconstruct the sticking out pipe. Alright. <laughs> oh dear. And connect this up. Oh no. Connect this up. Like so, instead. Liquid is running upwards. Liquid is going into here. Jim, 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 jim. Don't need this all anymore. Dum, 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 dum. Even though I like the cooling down, but what can we do? There is no coolant anymore. Deconstruct buildings. Mop up the liquids. Don't know where we're gonna put them. Gonna find a place, I'm sure. Possibly here somewhere. Just pour it out. <laughs> Good. Super S. Errands. Low priority. Priority number two now. You deliver the dirt. Yeah, they're cleaning up the base. Good. Dum 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 deconstruct dum dum dum. Starvation. Building in two men. Yeah, I know. How are they not digging this out? Are they not allowed? That's why. Let's allow them. 
good. They're gonna get scalded, but that's fine. Now, on the planetoid number one, the bleach stone storage bins are built. Bleach stone, party nine, copy settings. Auto sweeper will help. Build it and connect it to power. <coughs> Scalding. Uh -huh. But if this is priority 9, let's make it 8. Then if it was priority 9, then maybe they would not use the bleach zone here. I don't know, but I think they would. Farming is different from storing. They're going to take it out of storage. I think they would have. Good. I don't know if I have more of these. <laughs> don't know. We're also gonna see if that is happening. Yeah, we're going warm. There, we should go a little bit warmer. But cannot. But maybe we can again. Because since the oil is now here, we can reverse the bridges again. And run the hot oil in. Over here, go back and forth. Mm -hmm. Reverse. Down, down. Here as well, reverse. And connect it up. <coughs> and run a little bit of oil. This might be too much oil. Mm. This might be way too much oil. But it's gonna get stuck in the end. So no big deal. Good, we're building this up. Now, this is supposed to be a steam room. No stress, so let's build in the soggy feet machine. AKA liquid lock. Uh, point one. Liquid. Crude oil, enable drop, enable spill, enable bar party nine cup settings. If I may. Good, this is gonna be petroleum and disable the auto drop. <laughs> Just until the spec of liquid is in here. Good, but I do want this all out. So we're going to build a ventilation system, gas pump. Gonna use steel because we have it. And if there happens an accident with heat, then the steel will be robust enough and still keep up. Keep up there. Good gold is what we're using. It's connected up here, of course. There, deconstruct. Oops. Deconstruct the soul. Because of that. And <laughs> go in here. Alright, that makes more sense. <sighs> and the cooling loop here might be better running down where. <laughs> huh. What if I just use the, the water here? And cool it down once. Then it would be 15 degrees. Hmm. If I cool it down twice. <laughs> I could put it put it into the reservoir when I cool it down once. And I can put it into and then I keep running it out because it's gonna get stuck anyhow. It's gonna be at zero degrees about. Sure, let's not overcomplicate this. This is gonna be very straightforward. Um but I think I wanna use this. I cannot, can I? It's gonna sit in the pipes I don't like. We don't need to run this oil. Let's stop the madness. Good, no more. Tim, do we gonna abuse this pipe? Still not filled up. <laughs> but we will be. 
Hmm. I want to abuse this pipe for for that water there. Good, he has an autosave, which is great. So this is gonna look like that. I'm gonna go in, come in here. Cannot empty this out. Hmm, it's emptied out here. Deconstruct. Good. What we're gonna do is pour this out. Fakka says, I suppose it's time for some sleep. I'm really glad to hear overall everything went well today. And you're feeling good. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, you get to rest. I'm gonna play some uh, New Vegas later. On my own, because nobody cares for me playing that game. <laughs> um, but yeah, tonight, I don't know, another game or more rest time. I'm not sure. Either way, hope you sleep well, and I'm gonna see you soon. Hmm. So we're gonna empty out the hot oil here on the floor. Good, when it's not so hot anymore. Good. But uh, how do I make this now happen? Because I want to cool it down first before I... Pour it out. If I reverse this bridge, could already be enough, and we have overflow. Yep, that's what's gonna work. Right. <laughs> hmm. So we're just gonna I'm gonna pour the hot oil on the floor, so the pipe is free. And then we're going to put the water that comes from the base and goes into the toilet <laughs> and into the plants, incidentally. Are uh, we going to run this? Oh, that means we're going to have zero degrees water for the toilet here, which will cool down that area as well. And the same temperature as it is here. Mm. Well, as long as it's zero degrees, it's fine. And they're also somehow producing heat. 100 degrees hot carbon dioxide. Whoopsie doo. Because we're touching the hot abyssalite. So now, now we know how they're producing heat. Um, so yeah. It is a good idea to send the cold water in. <laughs> Maybe we're going to send it in even better. Like here. Good. So it can cool down in this area. <coughs> Act as a barrier for the duplicants not to get exposed to any heat from the abyssalite. Not that that is really the case. They never come here, but better safe than sorry. Good. Some plants are growing, some do not. Yes, we need to fix this. Just fix it. <laughs> This is not getting built. Probably nine on the construction. Check the errands. Maybe they can reach it. They can reach it. Good. This doesn't have power. Probably nine. Need to help this out. So duplicates don't uh, do this manually. Right. And we can stop the machines when these are full. Oh, if this was smart bins. Ah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> mm, then we stop the machines. So, I found a use for smart bins, you guys. The first time, the first time I played this game, I have a use for smart bins. Hmm. So, how do we do this? Just one smart bin? Yes, one smart bin is enough. And that smart bin is going to determine if you're producing more bleach or not. No, don't don't stop what you're doing just to breathe when you have enough oxygen. Hate it. Hate it. I hope they they implement a mechanic where the duplicate goes breathe in accordance to uh, how much oxygen they have left in their lungs and how far the oxygen is away. 
but I don't think that's ever gonna happen. Good automation shipping. Just a slide bar for the player. This is enough. Oxygen breathe threshold. That is enough. That is very easy to get a duplicate kill then with that bar with that slide bar. But um it would help out a ton. Um good, where is this? Is it not in a shipping? Smart bin? Let's check it out. Hmm. Smart storage bin. <coughs> Make it from gold. And connect it up to these things. Automation. Do I need a not gate? Sends the green signal when bin is full. So we have to reverse it. And we need three after all. Deconstruct. <laughs> so we reverse the signal on all of these. And if anyone sends a green signal, this is going to be a red signal. So if, if any one of these three is full, then we don't need to produce more bleach. I think that is a good idea. That is how you can do it without worrying too much. Oh, what the heck? We don't have room. Rotate. Sucketh a bit. But can't be out. <laughs> smart bin here, smart bin there. Mm, priority 9 on the construction. Use automation wire to make it happen. Good. Dum, dum, dum. What is this? Bleach stone, remove. <laughs> that was just temporary to get some bleach stone out. Hope we got it all out. No need to mop this. This is fine. Mm. How's the renovation work going? Somewhat. It is going somewhat. Priority 9 here as well. On the construction. It's gone on. Uzuni trapped. Oh, we never checked Uzuni. Uh, was there something we need to do here? Why don't we have power? Is this power only gonna go during the night? No, it's connected to the power spine. The power spine is broken. For some reason. Priority 9. Don't know what happened there. That is just for beacons. It's no big deal. Good. How's our liquid? Liquid is completely filled up. <coughs> Sorry. And we we'll keep pumping here all the time. Do I have some? Do I have some liquid for myself? Ah, some liquid water. That's good. That is my favorite. Can we make use of this here? I don't think so. Everybody's out and about in a suit, even the cock, c cook. Yes, and that should not be. I'm gonna cook the suit and deliver the suit. They must come here intermittently for some reason. Maybe to grab these things. I don't know. Good. Pick up the atmosphere suit. Hmm. Right, this is a brine. So if we deconstruct this all, we should have spillage again. Brine spillage. Let's try also and see if we can delete more pollution. <coughs> Where we can find it. Gonna make this relatively clear clean. It doesn't need to be too clean, of course. Da -da -da -da. Anything else we need to figure out here? Um, pressure is fine. Algae, we're not burning. 
auto driller is done it's gonna go back and bring all that algae we found that auto driller is ready to land on Lonido. good <coughs> deconstruct is that really the case <laughs> no <laughs> it's not the case good here's an artifact available let's go dig but there's another auto driller returning Meanwhile, the carbon dioxide rocket wants to go home as well. Because these stupids have nothing to do. Good. Why we're we not blinking? Because we're not oscill oscillating. For some reason. Oh, this is somewhat instant. <laughs> I think the oscillator is too fast. The oscillator is too fast. <coughs> or is this because we're connected up here? Mm. Good, let's do our standard then. Deconstruct. And put it in timer sensor instead. Good. Dun, dun. Is this a luxury barracks now? It is. Good. Dun, dun. So we're deconstructing the oscillator. Maybe I connected up to the wrong. <coughs> in out here. Not even sure. Good. Now, <laughs> get the signal thingy in. It's gonna be a timer sensor. Right, build it up because of the automation here. Good. And then we're gonna find out if we have blinkage. Probably yes. So we go yes, we go no. We go yes, we go no. That's good. Dun, dun, dun. All right. Hmm. <laughs> Otherwise, we're still cleaning up the base, which is all right, I guess. Here are the critters. Critters here are just going to eat up the rest of the food, which is fine. Good. I think I can send the pioneers home. Just have to make sure that an auditor is not in the way. This one is now landing. Good. So it's deal with the auditor while this rocket is on its way. Uh, we don't need to refill anything. Is all good. Still some liquid water left for the return home trip. Good. Change the crew. Magica and Punk W44 is alright. Um, should we get some glass because we have too much glass here? 2.6 tons. Or we could just leave it. Point 0.1, point 0.2, point 0.2 every second. And we have a pattern. <laughs> Is too long. Oh, this is beautiful. Maybe we should change the colors up. Elks. Good. Group settings. There we go. That is very nice. It's a it's a purple sparkle. Is what it is. <coughs> Should we do it the other way around? Should we do a blue sparkle? The green background. Uh, 
purple sky. Everything that is green must be purple. Scalding three, what the heck? What happened? This is hot again. No. What happened? Because <laughs> we were digging out something? Hmm. Where did they... Oh, they got scalded from the rocket. That's fine. Good. Remove this. Empty storage. Artifact transport remove. Turn this off. In the end, we're going to deconstruct this. Why not? I'll just leave it. Why not? <laughs> Um, hmm, a refuel. Alexa. No research focus, but that's fine. <laughs> Shoot that east. Mm, good, then we're gonna change destination into orbit. But which way? Good, can we drill this? This is collected. That is collected. Radioactive gas available. Either that or on this here. <coughs> Sandy ore field. Hmm. Still the sandy ore field. One, two, three, four, five, six. Must have twelve. Yeah, this must fuel up even more. Good, let's let it fuel up. Then we're gonna run it. And send the duplicants home now. Good. Change destination. Back home. Trip distance 3. Fueled. Acknowledge warnings and begin launch sequence. Good. The glass we're just going to leave here. It's fine. <laughs> Good. If anything, we're going to make new glass on the other colony. Alright. Purple needs to be green. Green and blue. Purple needs to be green and blue. Uh. Oh no, this will look different then. Purple just needs to be blue, doesn't it? And green needs to be purple. And blue needs to be green. Let's do the darker green even. Copy settings. Now we have a purple spark. We have a blue sparkle. In a purple background. With too much green. Hmm. I don't think I like it. This is something completely different then. <laughs> How about mm, this pattern then? Copy settings. Oh yeah, this is much better. Not sure if I like the lemon. Y you cannot see what's happening down here because of the big beds. But it's fine. Don't know about the green, though. It's good with that color, but not with the pink. Maybe the pink is the problem. What if we do something crazy like this? This ugly red. <laughs> Much better. But then we have the red here. Mmm, no. I kind of like the pink. Let's do a pink that is... Let's do a rose pink. That is uh, fitting more. More with the yellow, with the lime yellow. Mm. Lime yellow is still a little bit bitey. But it's so good with this green here. What if we do something neutral? Instead of the pink, like either white or black. 
Let's do pitch black. See how that looks. Oh yeah. That looks genius. And well, the, dupl the duplicates will uh, will love it <laughs> when they return. <laughs> right now they're gone. Good consumables. They are allowed the space food again. Otherwise they cannot eat. <laughs> Give them the pills as well. Why not? Good, we're going to land here. But that thing is almost ready to go. What's your range? 17 tiles. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Good, let's launch it. Change destination. Orbit. Begin launch sequence. Stop this madness. <coughs> Are we filled up? Travis Lander check. Diamond check. Good, Zarya should be coming. Check the crew. Uh, Agent artist Zarya. And there she comes. You can uh, recognize her easily with a fake Atmos suit. Good, it's a graphical glitch when you use the Trailblazer. And you're not in an Atmos suit, and Dupkins will uh, put on their Atmos suit. Graphically, not in the game, so they can still suffocate. But it looks like they're wearing one. Good, so the rocket is starting. Very good. And it is in space. Over here. Bzzzt. Order. Select duplicant. Deploy. <laughs> Put them here. Back on the planetoid. And the other rocket immediately is landing. Good. Consumables. Pause the game. I don't want the game to glitch me over. Good. There we go. <laughs> this is the smallest rocket. Good. Wonder if I can just put in a different engine. But I wanna do in solar panels as well. So deconstruct the ladders. Deconstruct. Change the engine up. Go what was the alert? I don't know. Mm-hmm. Where's the Red Bolt engine? Oh, we cannot do it. Because the ladders are not deconstructed yet. There's something to be said for having a gantry. <laughs> is it? Is it called a gantry? I think it is. Rocketry? Gantry. So why am I never building this? This is useful. This is very useful. Why is this not being built? <laughs> Takes a little bit of power, but power we have. Check the power so I know what side I'm going to build it on. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Could do the fatty power from there. If I put it here... Rocket will definitely wreck it. Here is where I need to put it. Um, how do I get this power over? Steel. And then... <coughs> and then just run it. Possibly. Okay, let's try. Deconstructing buildings over here. What are we bringing? Are we bringing bleach stone into the toilet thing? Ah, does this have to be? Let's make this grounded as well, so that we can don't use up the water. Good. Then we have to run a cooling loop there through as well, and we have to tell them to analyze the seed. No need to tell them they're going to do it, but they're going to do it. Uh, with their priority. 
Researching or farming? <laughs> Quite a learned skill. Many people could do this. But they require the skill. Skills? On loan, you know. Agent artist. Who has the high agriculture? Zero? Zero, zero. Must be one of the ranchers. 27. 10. Is a rancher artist chef? Oh, they already know so much. But now they know more. Good. Right, this should be priority 9. And they're gonna do it. They still have other things to do first, though. And what could that be? Relax on the beach chair. Oh well, <laughs> if that is what they need to do, then I guess we're gonna let them do it. Carbon dioxide engine, switch it out. I want a Red Bolt engine again. Build it, please. No, the resources dropped down. <coughs> Grab him. Jim, Jim. Is this hot? 300C. 600C obsidian. Yeah, <laughs> dude, I just told you not to do it. Why are you still doing it? Um, that will cause an accident. Probably, depending on where they're gonna bring it and where it's gonna drop. If it drops down here into that liquid, it's gonna flash into steam. Hmm. Let's move up this liquid and see what it gives. Good. <coughs> oh man, I'm sorry. Now the cooling loop. This one here is doing something. Doesn't matter what it does. <laughs> but the cooling loop here is the important one. Lunido beds. What? I don't think we have a guest chamber for pioneers. Spindy Grafford, Rose Grafford, not it's all good. They're eating. No guest chamber for pioneers. Two, four, six, eight, ten. We have twenty duplicates here. Uh, kind of want a guest chamber. Deconstruct. Good. Build more beds. <laughs> one goes here. And one goes there. Good, straightforward. Ugh, this, this is... Then on top of here, but that's fine, right? I think so. Igneous rock. Good. Some airflow. Pretty nice guest chamber is good enough. Need background tiles <laughs> or not? We're gonna keep this simple. Um, instead, we could do pedestals. Bunch of them. Good. <laughs> So what is there needed for a uh, art chamber? Hmm. Art museum. Potential six masterpieces, a light source, no industrial machinery. So beds are fine? Don't know. Seat and all is complete. Good. It's a wildish dash of salt vine. Oh, it's a dash of salt vine. <gasps> Rip it out. Rip it out. I'll leave it in. Who cares? These are enabled by the automation grid. Hmm. Do you have to power these? That's a bit awkward. But whatever. Waiting for materials is all right. Storing zero. What are we sending? A red sickness. So these are going. 
So if any one of these goes full with the bleach stone, we're not gonna make any no more new seed analysis complete. More dash of salt wine. Super specialized. Sweet. So rip out these and put in super specialized instead. Good. <coughs> Just so kicks. It's gonna mess with the room, isn't it? But it's fine. Good. Smart storage spin. Uh, a bit bin. Bleach stone. Priority nine. Copy settings. Good. Our bleach stone is gonna get put in. We need to power them to send a signal. I don't think so. Source of solid smart storage can automate resource organization based on type and mass. Power sixty watts. I don't know. But they're producing heat, so that's good. Are they? They must. Yep. 125 DTU. Seed analysis complete. Or was this the third one? Wildish, super specialized. Leafy grub fruit. Thimble reed, lysi. <gasps> A lysi thimble reed? Nice. You need to plant it. Good. Oh, this is all good news. This is a good episode. Uh, very much fun. And we're getting closer to our all achievements. What's going on here? How come I have no power? Is that normal? Oh, it's a power outage somehow. Hmm. Let's use even more power up. Just to get this rocket fueled. Good. Now we need to bring liquid water in. And we need to cool that water down as well. But one cooling project at a time. Good. Liquid water is coming in here. Should we just deconstruct the bridge? Or let's reverse it for the time being. Good. Liquid water goes in. <coughs> Like so. Deconstruct the vent. And then uh, and then liquid water goes out. Good. If the temperature is correct. And then liquid water goes into a reservoir. And then liquid water goes into this aqua tuna. Let's see if that will work. And we're gonna run the liquid water. Hey, if this goes up here first, that is very reasonable here. Good, we're going in. And we're coming out. This is good enough. Going in here, coming out there. Dum, dum, dum. That's not how it looks, is it? This is how it looks. <laughs> Reservoir. Liquid. Aluminum ore. Good. And will I have a cooling loop here? We can extend this anytime. Uh, as a cooling loop for the base. Even though the temperature is pretty much determined by the liquid that we get for oxygen and power <laughs> so yeah I don't know sure we can determine it here deconstruct or we could try to determine the heat the uh, the temperature hmm let's connect it up good run through this is nothing but a security. Nothing but a security system. And why are you running Wonker, Wonker out here? Because maybe I use this area. It's fine. And I have pipe in as well. Already. So it's good. <laughs> Deconstruct. Alright. And then it's going out. 
deconstruct that. <laughs> and then we're going in here at nominal temperatures and connecting up there. Now we're going the wrong way now. Deconstruct. Going the wrong way now. Mm. Connect it here. Good. Right, and then I don't know what to do with this. Because we abused the array that we're using for... <laughs> Pollution, but we have a lot of polluted water here. And let's look at the temperatures completely nominal. This is also helping out with the rest of the biome because we run a loop here and use conductish, conductish panels. Hmm, but yeah, this is all very important. Let's just keep going. Um, pumping out. <laughs> Ventilation. I want this to be a vacuum. Good. Gas pipe. Just get out of here. Anyway is good way. Will this over pressure? No. No, we barely have any pressure here. For some reason. I guess it's intermittent power outages. Liquid we have. Liquid. <laughs> I think we have enough liquid. The number again is so big I cannot read it. Not at first glance. Not that good at math. Somebody would immediately see, oh that's seven ditches, so it's gotta be a million. But not me. Hmm. I suppose I could practice. Now here goes in a little bit of liquid. And it's immediately going out. Don't like that much, though. I want this to fill up first. Do I? Nah, it's gonna fill up automatically. We're gonna be just fine. This water here is going in. Let's run it in. Da, da. <coughs> now we have a green there. Yep, we have to get rid of the bridge. Deconstruct. And then the liquid will flow because then there's only uh, whites on one side of the pipe. And that green here will say push push. And the white will say suck suck. <laughs> and then the liquid is going to flow. It's going to flow into the aqua tuner. And the aqua is going to get tuned up to sufficient temperatures. Oh, this is the wrong thing. Liquid pipe element sensor deconstruct. So we're running already, and we don't even have overflow. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess it doesn't matter what sensor is here. This is just going to run for the time being. Or is it red? No, it's red, so it's not going to run, so it's going to be stuck. That's fine. Good, but then the overflow is going out. We're going to do this all, but the right sensor first. And what is this? Liquid pipe element sensor again. What the heck? Deconstruct. Good, we're also making a vacuum here. This duplicate is complaining because it's too hot. 36 degrees, what the heck are you talking about? Good, then we don't have automation in there. Why? Good, the right battery is controlling. Not gate is going in here. Or gate is connecting up. <laughs> right, but next time I'm going to use Fractal's design for power distribution. I think it's um, definitely less readable because it's more compact and it employs some bridges. But it is very elegant because there's a lot of symmetry in that design. I like it very much. Not gate. Rotate. Put it in. So next time, we're going to use Fractal's design. Um, so what is the right thing? To 
to determine the temperature of a liquid. It's a liquid pipe thermosensor, isn't it? Of course it is. Liquid pipe thermosensor. <coughs> Good. And then we're going to determine the temperature here. So we're going to do 14 there. And I don't know, don't care. Well, 20, 28 there. Gonna make it just normal. 14. So if we're above 14, I want it cooled down. We could do even 13, that would be 14. <laughs> so if it's 13.3, it's gonna cool down, but it's not gonna freeze. Because it's, uh, it's a margin of 3 degrees. And we leave a yet more margin, just so we don't get uh, into trouble. <laughs> they were going to do something similar. So we're looking for 14 plus 14 is 28. So we're going to do 27 degrees. If we're above 27 degrees, cool it down. Good. Is this automation here working? Don't have any power. So we're enabled. Is that really how it works? No, we're enabled because... <coughs> This one is not sending a green signal. Yeah, it's only going to send a green signal when we have power. <laughs> that's cute. That's cute. And that's actually perfect. Because if we don't have power, then we're not producing any So that's fine. Um, brown out here. Or is this not even connected up? It's not even connected up. Don't know what I'm using this for. No idea. For nothing. Probably. Good. This hasn't been working forever. Let's do sweep only. Good. <coughs> now we still have fishies here. Mm, and what is this? We don't need configuration, but we need configuration here. This also needs configuration. This also does not need configuration. So these are good. Dedicated power to over there. We're not connected up. Let's do that. Um, automation we also need. Just uh, smart thing. Oh, we already have it in there. That's good. So this is 13 and this is going to be 27. If we're above... 27, please cool down. We run out of power constantly now. Good. That is absolutely fair. How is the situation looking here? We have liquid water. Good. Temperature is too high intermittently. That's fine. So this is looking for chlorine. And the other one is looking for carbon dioxide between the both of them. They're going to find something, and that pump is going to pump. Maybe we should have set them down even further, so this is here. Yeah. What am I doing? Da -da -da. Buffer gate. <coughs> yeah, that is actually normal. That is not. Good, build it up. Mm, doo -doo 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 -doo. These guys are just gonna die. For a lot of polluted oxygen, you know, for some reason. Yeah, they don't have a great time, despite the disco ball. But is alright. Mm, this is done. Bomb ladies are growing. Beautiful. Let's enable the... Wait a minute, can we irradiate a ball nearly? Not sure we can. I just meant to press F5 for a quick save. I'm saving now because I'm switching up menus. I'm going into the achievement menu. And if the game crashes, then I saved. But the game is extremely stable. Crashes only sometimes. Uh, especially if you use mods. This is done. Um, <laughs> colony summary, that's right. Colony summary. We're going to look at the 
G-M-O-A, okay. Gas grass, dust cap, water weed, pinch up bulk, bomb lily, mutant. So bomb lily can mutate. How much radiation is he? 120, we need this. We need this? Party nine. Errands, number one. Man, all this time I'm growing the bomb, eh? Well, it's not all the time. This was heating, this needed heating up. And it's now heated up sufficiently. Good. Because we poured the hot oil. Ah, 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 what a beautiful chamber. Good, full of chlorine. Let's check the germs. <laughs> Clean. Not that there were germs before. But um, good. This is also getting done. Oops. We're losing atmosphere. And this is now oxygen. Don't like that much. Let's paint this in. <laughs> this might be too much. Don't know. Let's dig it out and find out. Party nine on the construction. Good. Yeah, but the chlorine. We have a solution for the chlorine now. Dublin is gonna come and bring it into the smart storage bin if we find it lying about. And it is a current errand. Hmm. Are we taking it from here? That room must be decommissioned. Deconstruct. Also stop the madness. Good. <laughs> that was the old system. I was just experimenting. Hmm. What if? And then we go here and immediately get the mutations. So good. So good. Just systematically mutate the plants. Anything else? Or the seeds, rather. For the plants. Research. Could we do some research? Just so that we can get that achievement. Here is something missing. Let's do that then. Good. But this is going to be rough. It's going to be too hot very soon. Check the gases. Down to milligrams. Good. And then we have to pour liquid water on top. We're just going to connect this up here. And it's going to work out. A little bit of liquid coming now here. <coughs> Good, filling this all up. But yeah, we need the overflow system and everything. I guess we could build it in. But that will then overflow even if the thermo aqua tuna is browning out, which is a bit rough. All right, let's build it in. Overflow. Oh, here in this case there. Good. Plumbing liquid bridge from granite, yes. Here there's a pipe missing. Whoosh. <laughs> Here is the granite liquid bridge. Boop. Good. Build it up before it's too hot. Don't get scalded. And uh, when there's no more of these gases, is good. But tell you what, not sure if I want to cool this down intermittently. Hmm. We're stuck now, which is good. That is perfect. Pipe is blocked. <laughs> when is this ever gonna run? Oops, excuse me. I don't even know. Pipe is blocked. But we are flowing out. I guess when this empties out, it's gonna go boop, boop. It's gonna do a 10 key batch. Like it did just now. <laughs> Good, let's look at the temperatures as well. Seven degrees, coming in at 22 degrees. Mm hmm And it's intermittent. Hope these plants are sucking up the liquid. So we have an intermittent flow. 
if the water sits there too much in the hot pipe, it's going to take on the temperature despite it being insulated. But it's not going to sit there for 100 cycles. I don't think. Good. Now, <laughs> more water is coming in. A little bit of power abusage. Auction is at milligrams. That thing is not connected to a power wire. Good, let's just do a little bit of power then. No need to put this inside the chamber. Let's just put it here. Does not matter. Let's make it from steel as well. And lose, uh, use aluminum, which we have. Oh, there's a different one here. No problem. Copper. Good. Build it up immediately. And then we're going to pour some liquid on top. What is the temperature? 70 degrees. So the duplicates are going to get scalded now if they come here. I hope they don't. <laughs> There's still a piece of debris. And take it out. But otherwise the chamber is complete. There is nothing else needed here. Just two aqua tuners. Three power distributions. One power distribution is for the base. Yes. And one power distribution is for the aqua tuner and the bristleberry farms. And a little bit of this jazz. So this is just an experiment. I want to try with the critter. I want to try play with the critter morphs. That is a mod. And uh, this is a, the leafy slickster. <laughs> the leafy slickster. It's a pretty cool critter. They need light, and they suck up oxygen, and they produce uh, bristleberries. It's pretty cool. Good. Do they still drop meat when they die? I wonder. What what are they pooping out? Liquid oxygen, algae, and slime they're pooping out. And when they die, they produce a bristle blossom. So now we're producing slime because we uh, had the unfortunate incident of polluted oxygen, which they're breathing out. And that is a catch-22. <laughs> so this was a nice experiment, but I think I'm going to end it. Good. Boom, 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 boom. There's still one egg, though. Good. Please autosave. So I can put the egg somewhere. They need light. Let's move it to... Here, where they can die in peace. <laughs> and darkness. I could make them a light, come on. There is light here. Hold on, where is it shining? Everywhere but there. Well, everywhere but there means we need light. Good. <laughs> no more power for this all. Dum, 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 that brakeen is lost. Should we plant more of these? <laughs> Copy settings. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. I know they're not gonna r run. Because it's too warm. But that will change. That will change come time. We have a minus three apparently only. We have a minus eight here, degrees Celsius in that liquid collection. Um, we have four resorts working hard. And the liquid water that is breaking everything here. And because it's heating up the pots, the hydroponic farms, um, is also going to get cooled down in the future. So we're coming in at 8.6 degrees now, which is still too warm. But it's better than 20, 
which which one was coming in before and uh, before it was 35 or something actually good so we're waiting on this to vacuum out <laughs> what is the other colonies doing there is eight duplicates here again we have oxygen do we have liquid though is the question Ah, oh, the desalinator is now working that means we have liquid good let's deconstruct the pipes we no longer need as well as the pump we can increase the farm size this is a farming plant or these are farmers <laughs> hey and this looks now nice i like it it's a farming pattern the the dark black is for the nothingness that gets replaced by this earthy blue and uh, the uh, life suggesting green here so yeah They're, these duplicates are proud <laughs> so the only thing we need now on this planetoid is a suicide chamber because all these proud duplicates are gonna are gonna suicide in the end because i'm not gonna build atmos suits for everybody and then make sure they they have their chore because that is that is a true chore definitely um, everybody is gonna die here and only two duplicates are gonna be left on the Uzani where they can then uh, slip into their suits and I'm gonna find out what is a chore and what is not and uh, then when we got the last achievement the job suitability we're gonna send them into the temple chair win the game and that is going to be yet another all achievements run complete i'm excited i hope they don't patch the game so that the world gen mod breaks my safe that would be bad i would have to start over but um i think the next all achievement run is going to be on an unmodded world gen actually what it should be it should be completely unmodded Oof. That is a huge challenge. Because there's so much busy work. And we're going to switch to ugly locks. So I have jump locks now. And liquid locks that are two tiles high. And corner liquid locks, one drop. And uh, all that fancy pawancy. And making these as possible. Definitely. Without using mods, but... Without the hauling mod, it's just so much busy work doing this. Yeah, it's gonna suck. <laughs> but hey, we only need all achievements, right? So we don't have to worry too much about jump blocks and looking good. If we do all achievements, we're not gonna come here and build the space. We're not gonna tame the tungsten volcanoes for what? <laughs> Makes no sense. Nonsense. Hmm. Not gonna terraform. So yeah. So for this fun run, this is good. Hmm. Uh, anything else? What about the uh, the other planetoids? Uzani looks good. Did we miss anything? Pollution seems to be gone. Nope. It's not gone. It's still pollution. Let's kill it here and there. Is this petroleum? This is polluted water. Let's kill it. This is polluted water. Let's kill it. This is petroleum. Let's move it up. This is polluted water. Oh, we gotta be careful here. Uh, let's leave it in. I don't want to mess with this environment. <coughs> so, if the, oh, how come this is not spilling here? Must spill there. If I deconstruct the tile, we're coming from up here. Displacing the hydrogen gas is not going to be great. But I just want a little bit of water. Also, we can deconstruct these pipes. They're no longer needed. Good. <laughs> How is this not spilling to the right? Oh, it's... Uh, I know what it is. It is the water underneath the neutronium. It's stuck. It's simply stuck. 
Could we have done this one tile over in theory? Damn it. I think we could have done this one tile over. How do I make this happen? If I make a hydrogen piece here, it's just going to break the thing. Oh, and if this if this breaks, it's going to be in deep, deep doo-doo. Uh, is there any solution? I need this to be to spill over. If there was petroleum here, would it spill over there into the water? <laughs> I don't think so, really. I think we have to delete the water. <laughs> Somehow, but if I build towns, it's just going to push the water. It's not going to delete it. If I build airflow towns, push it all in. I'm just going to pump it. I'm just going to pump I just deconstructed the pump that was there. Ay, 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 ay. The pipe is blocked here. Mm, there is a pipeway, so that's good. It's probably power as well. Yeah, we need a pump here. There's no two ways about it. Here, probably, is where we need to pump. <laughs> we pump up there. It's going to be sufficient. Let's do the sufficient pump. Build a pump from gold amalgam. Right. <laughs> Doesn't matter. <laughs> there. Good. And then we're going to pump it in. Good. In the meantime, how do we use this water up? <laughs> I don't know. Too much water is a good problem. It's a good problem to have. Let's move up this all. For even more too much water. This is dropping liquid pollution. Not water, please. I'm gonna drop water here. And... Why is this not a different tile? Doesn't matter. Let's keep it in. I wanna have this pour out. Move up that piece. <laughs> and we're gonna pump it all around. Yeah, we can renovate a little bit. This chamber, the fishy chamber, we should renovate completely. If we have the time to do it. <laughs> I think we do. But yeah, I think uh, since everything worked nicely, and the algae thingy is back again as well, I think I'm gonna call it good for today. Um, this was a good episode, short as it might be, but we did a lot, and it was very good. I'm going to take a brief break, and then I'm going to be back with the New Vegas, Fallout New Vegas, which is pretty exciting. I'm going to do a stealth build, and uh, collect the skill books, go for 100 skill points everywhere, completionist run, on the highest difficulty settings, of course. Hardcore mode, even, which doesn't seem to be too bad. Um, slash of detection, good. the The difference is that that you need to eat and you need to sleep, apparently, which I haven't found out yet. Maybe it's because I'm only um, up for three days there, or so. I have to take some re do some research. A Lunita toilets. What and what is this brown out? Mm, it's intermittent brownouts, yeah. Uh, what we have to do is hopefully get this into a vacuum, drop some liquid on top, and then get this room going. And that is going to be for next time. That is a supplement power with a petroleum generator. Hope everything is in. And emitting natural gas? 
Hmm, space exposure, hold on. Is there space exposure here somewhere? It says natural gas, space exposure here. Was it kidding? No, it says natural gas, space exposure. Four key. Oh, there is space exposure, isn't there? Good, let's build it up. Fresh light. <coughs> Because we have here enough diamond temperature plates in the background. Good, good catch at the end of the stream. So thank you, thank you, thank you for watching. And thanks for chiming in. And I'm going to see you real soon. Until then, have a good day and a good night.